What are you doing out here? How long have you been out here? Well, we stayed in, had a good long talk. And when I woke up, she was gone. We need to talk to you about something. We're gonna need you to move out soon. Yen was supposed to talk to you about this. I didn't lock you out last night. Yen must have locked the door when she left. Ready for what? What? Ivy, the military. Good luck with that. Oh, no, no. If you want to stay in your room and stay in your bed and be miserable, fine by me. I know you're giving me the silent treatment, but did you lock your friend out last night? <laughs> Fuck this shit. Those scores are impressive. What do they mean? These scores here show that you scored higher for jobs in the Navy, and in the Marines, and the Army lines. Well, the military can be a dangerous place for a woman. I'm surprised you joined. Yeah. Where's she at? She left the work already. That's odd. We had an argument earlier, so she went on to work. Well, she's going through one of her depression phases. So how soon do you think you can move out? I mean, my family's visiting next week. Can you leave before then? Yeah, and I just think that Yen and I would really benefit from some time alone together. No, oh, thanks, Ivy, and good luck with the military. Thanks. Yeah, jobs are tough around here. Oh, Ivy. Yeah? Your ex called. Yeah. He said he got it from Yen's family. Yeah. He called and was trying to ask some questions about you, but I wasn't answering any of them. Yeah, we have to talk about that, Ivy. Yen's in jail. The club you two work at got raided. Drugs, prostitution, a whole lot of stuff. Yeah, that's what I was telling them. Yeah, I was in the parking lot there just waiting to go pick her up. And police swarmed the place. Yeah, and I just spent the last three hours trying to bail her out. Well, they haven't set bail yet. Besides the club stuff, she was busted before for having a whole lot of drugs on her. Well, she skipped bail a few times. Nothing we can do about it, at least until the morning. Go there tomorrow, and we'll find out when they finally get her arraigned. She gets arraigned in the morning, but we got another problem. What money? Are you sure you're going to put someplace else? Yeah, I'm sure. Well, I don't come in here, so... Well, maybe you just misplaced it, or forgot to spend it. Nobody comes in here. I know I didn't steal it, and I can't think of any of my friends who would steal it. Maybe you just lost it. Ivy, mean, you're going to have to move out by tomorrow. What? My family's coming down to help with the end. They're gonna be staying here, and they do pay for this place, and we're not supposed to have roommates. I'm gonna meet up with them at the courthouse, so if you just, you know, go have your stuff out by 10. Ivy, mean, don't come down to the courthouse. If you work at the club, that's not gonna help things. I need their help. So, just give me a call tomorrow, and I'll let you know what's going on. Ivy, drive safe and be careful out there. Sorry about what happened to your money. All right, well, I'm headed off to court. See you later.